Hey guys, welcome here to this wonderful community here, Haven Oaks right here in Orlando, Florida. And I am so excited to showcase this home here today. spans an expansive 3,000 square foot plus. It's a four bedroom, three and a half bath with a three car garage. It's a two story home with an amazing pool. I cannot wait to show you and all the amazing finishes that you have in here. And guys, this community right here where we sit at, this is like right in the middle of everything. I mean, downtown Orlando is super close. The Orlando International Airport is right down the road. All your theme parks are very close. You know, you have Interstate I-4 that's right here, so it's easy for you to get up to the beaches, the world famous Daytona Beach, New Smyrna Beach, or you could jump on the toll roads out here and take it straight out to Coco. This is an amazing location, guys. I can't wait to show you this. Let's get this tour started. Come on in. And as we come up here, you see this beautiful two-car garage with the coach lights right here on the outside. Nice brick pavers coming in here. And the other great thing about this home too is, is you can see that there are eight foot doors here, which is absolutely amazing. And all the interior doors also. Hey guys, by the way, my name is James Bessinger and I am your top real estate professional here in Orlando, Florida, specializing in this area here. And please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And all my contact information is right below. So right off the bat here, we have our home office right here, which is an amazing location. It has two windows that's letting an abundance of light coming right into the front door. And we have this beautiful foyer here, extra wide, 10 foot ceilings. And just look at all the craftsmanship, all the trim work throughout this home. As we go through here, you're gonna notice it especially with these amazing engineered hardwood floors. And as we go this way, we're gonna go into the first bathroom here. And I just love how they have the subway tiles running vertically all the way up to the ceiling with this beautiful transom window, letting an abundance of light in here with your white quartz countertop here with the shaker style vanity. But it's not just a regular shaker style door. It has an extra piece of style going around the door, which just gives it that extra little touch and character. And as we walk out of here, we're gonna take you to the left over here and we're gonna go into the bedroom number one right here. And these bedrooms are really nice. You don't see any doors on the closets right now just because this is a model home. But these doors, is these are just sliding doors. So you don't have to worry about the old bifold doors that's always giving you problems, which is a big thing for me. I love these style doors. They either gotta be hinged or sliding. We have one window here that's letting an abundance of light in. These are all double pane, low E windows that let a lot of light in, but leave all those harmful sun rays outside. Okay, so let's come on this way. As we walk back into here to this nice foyer, it's just so nice because as you walk in here, it just opens up right here. It's very welcoming. You have a little area right here where you can hang your purse, your hat, you know, anything that you want to kind of drop off. It's kind of like a drop zone area right here with your stairs going up with a nice, beautiful null post here with the stained wood railing and your wood spindles. As we continue on this way here, we have our laundry room over here. And I like these very decorative tiles they have in here. You know, we have our same style cabinet right here as we did in the vanities in that bathroom number one quartz top with a beautiful fixture here. I love this copper color on the actual plumbing fixtures. And this is a very spacious laundry room. Well done. And I have to say this house here, they have everything planned out so well in here. And there's just so much space, it's so spacious and inviting. Here is the half bath right here to the right. We have a freestanding pedestal sink here, Kohler sink with the copper looking plumbing fixtures here and obviously your toilet. I love how they have the wall coming up with the chair rail going around, you know, about three foot up. Gives it that extra little touch and shows a lot of character, right? And as we come into here, this is your flex space in this home. 
you know, you could sit in here, it could be used for your kids or for you for a little movie room to watch movies, play video games, or have your little office in here with one light, letting an abundance of light in through this area also. And it just feels so nice in here because it's these 10 foot ceilings, right? And these eight foot doors everywhere throughout this home that you're gonna see. So all your interior doors and exterior doors are eight foot. And as we come this way, I'm gonna take you out to the amazing three car garage for all you car enthusiasts, right? That need this space. And it's very nice. It jogs up here a little bit. So you have a little bit more storage up in the corner up there where the hot water heater is. Nice, well done, high ceilings out here. So you can add shelving up above your garage doors, which I highly recommend for more storage. And I personally have that in my house too. And it just keeps everything out of the way. And I just love this foyer. You have three light fixtures coming on down through here with this engineered hardwood floors running perpendicular to the back of the house and the front of the house that just make it feel so big and so long, okay? And as we come around here, we're gonna take a left. And when I would bring you guys into this actual living room here, and I just love these beams going, you know, across the ceiling here all the trim work coming down the doors here. So spacious. I mean, you could just sit right here, look over this pool. I mean, look how amazing this pool is. You know, it's got a nice outdoor kitchen. We'll get to that in a minute. But uh, this space here is just wide open for setup for entertaining. A nice kitchen nook area right here. And look at this stylish couch here. Let me know what you guys think about that. I've never seen something like this in a kitchen. Round table with this sectional like this that goes around, that's really cool. It's like a half circle couch. I'd like to see in the comments what you guys think about that. And look at this light fixture they have here. This thing is just really cool looking. I have never seen this yet. And I see a lot of homes, never seen this fixture right here. And as we come into this kitchen, just look how big and grand this actual island is here. I love this waterfall edge going all the way down to the floor. Beautiful quartz tops. We have your dishwasher right here. It's an all Whirlpool appliance package. You'll see throughout this home. We have this nice white granite Kohler undermounted farm sink with the copper plumbing fixtures here. I absolutely love because they've matched these beautiful, amazing looking pendant lights up there. Those look absolutely stunning. And not just that, what do you guys think about these cabinets that have the extra cabinets on top? So we have 42 inch upper cabinets here, right? And then we have your 12 inch cabinets up above that with furniture board going around the whole perimeter up there. And I love how they have those lights and the, the doors up there that have the glass panels in there showing off whatever you want, you know, decorations up there, how they have the place that looks absolutely gorgeous. Love the quartz tops in here. We have a five burner, 36 inch wide glass cooktop here with a vent hood that vents outside of the house so you don't have to worry about any of the smells when you're cooking with spices and whatnot they have a beautiful drawer bank right here for storage in there light rail molding along all the bottoms of your cabinets and what that does is it hides the light fixtures underneath here you can see this glow that's coming down on here that's just an extra little touch that this builder does that sets them apart from everybody else and as we carry on over here we have the wall mounted oven cabinet, which this cabinet comes out 24 inches and it gives a lot of different depth and more character in this kitchen, a lot more style with the microwave right up here above that. We have our walk-in pantry over here. Little nook area right here for the coffee maker. And here we are, I love how they have this built in right here for the actual refrigerator and how they have this 42 inch upper refrigerator wall cabinet here. Looks absolutely amazing. And not just that, I love the actual hardware that they have on these cabinets. Looks absolutely stunning. And now what I wanna do is I wanna carry on over here and take you guys into this master suite over here and show you guys what this thing is all about. It's absolutely stunning. I love how it walks in here and you have a separate entry coming into the actual bedroom here and just, this just feels so good, right? We have three windows right here, letting an abundance of light in, right? They did not like skimp on anything. All their window sills, wood routed, all the trim work throughout this home. 
five and a quarter inch baseboards and I love how they have the engineered hard wood up in the actual ceiling of this tray ceiling in here, right? So these ceilings are 10 foot high. You're very spacious. You got plenty of elbow room over here, right? So things aren't crammed in, spaced out very well. I love this and I just love all this trim work. I know I keep saying it, but guys, let me know in the comments if you like this or would you like your walls just to be bare, right? Because I really like this a lot. Now, as we come this way, here we go into the actual on master on suite here. And I just love this. Same style vanity cabinets, very uniform throughout the whole home. Okay, and we have a double vanity sinks here with your quartz tops, herringbone tile going all the way up to the ceiling with our walk-in shower here with a 12 by 24, 30, 70 pattern all the way up to the ceiling. I love that and I love this freestanding tub here with the copper fixture. It just looks absolutely stunning. And uh, these are the things this builder does just to set them apart from other people. You know, like some of them will have a tub like this tucked in, some are really crammed. This has space all around that and I love that. Looks really good, especially with the transom window up above letting natural light in here. And then we have a nice walk-in closet over here. your water closet right here where your toilet is. Very nice and well done. And again, you know, we have our eight foot openings for all of our doors throughout here that just makes the house that much more grand and bigger. So let's go ahead and go upstairs and show you guys what we have up here. And actually, before we go out there, let's take a look at the actual back porch, the outdoor kitchen and the swimming pool area. A three panel pocket door here that way you could just open up and make this outdoor space your indoor living area or outdoor living area however you want to put that and this is a huge cover to the eye look how big this is back here it spans the whole width of the actual house and over here we have our outdoor kitchen with the true flame grill here we have our stainless steel cabinets underneath here, below the sink over there, granite countertops, our hair and bone backsplash here going up to this commercial grade vent hood, right? So when you're barbecuing, you know you have all the smoke going everywhere. This is super powerful and it's gonna blow everything right outside the, the, uh, the back side of the house over here. Very nice. And I love these pavers here with this ashlar pattern that they have here. And the, the reason why is, is because with regular, you know, brick pavers, the darker ones, especially here in Florida, they tend to get really hot, right? And with these light colored ones here like this, they don't get too hot. They actually have a bit of a cool feel to them when you're walking on them. And I love this actual pool. We have a sun deck over here for you to lounge in. Some arbors over here with a little fire pit. Very nice. I love this style. I mean, the architectural design around everything around here is just absolutely beautiful. And guys, this house is gonna be available for you guys to purchase too. So if you guys like everything about this or you'd like to see something different in here, please leave it in the comments below. But uh, we're getting a lot of really good feedback. This house isn't gonna last long. There's a lot of good feedback on this. So let's go back inside the home and we're gonna go upstairs and I wanna show you what we have up there. Beautiful. And as you walk in here, it's just so open and grand feeling. Extra wide for your hall right here. And as you come up, I love how they have the risers and the treads match here. Some people will have white ones, but I really like this, how this engineered hardwood is going right up here. Very well done. I love this design. Nice. And yeah, as we come up here, we got the, the loft, the game room. We have the table set up here for Scrabble. I know my good friend Derek, he's addicted to Scrabble and they love it. They play it just about every night. I mean, this space here is just so awesome, right? Like if you have kids, they could be up here doing their homework, doing any of their work, hanging out with their friends, watching TV, playing games by you and your husband or your wife, you guys are downstairs entertaining. The kids are all up here, staying out of everybody's way. 
Very nice. I love how they have this trim going all the way across the ceiling, down the wall on both sides with the two-tone on the paint up there. Looks very good, very sharp. Here we have an actual closet. And then as we come this way, we're going to come into the bathroom up here. And I love these tiles. They have the 12 by 24 tiles here on the floor. And then they have the subway tiles up here in a 50-50 pattern going all the way up to the ceiling. They look absolutely amazing with your shaker style cabinet with the extra style on the doors with the quartz top and an undermounted sink in here. Very nice. And then we'll come in here into the final bedroom of the home. And we have two windows overlooking the front of the home over here, letting all that nice natural light in here. And I love this blue wall here, especially with the trim offset like this throughout there. It looks very good. And these lights, guys, let me know in the comments about these lights. This is one of my favorite things to see in these homes these days is these lights that are coming down from the ceiling onto the actual nightstand. Looks absolutely amazing. And we have a nice walk-in closet over here too. So that's it, guys. That's the end of the tour today. So if you guys are looking to buy, you know, relocate, you know, or sell any real estate or just want to invest, please don't hesitate to give me James Bessinger a call and all my contact information is below. And don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I'll see you on the next video.